how to use Hootsuite for beginners tutorial 2022. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use Hootsuite to manage your social media platform. So let's get into it. Now, first off, you're just gonna go on to hootsuite.com and the actual way to get started with their free version or their free trial is not to click on request a demo over here because for that, you're actually gonna have to wait for a demo. What you're gonna do is you're just gonna click on plans over here. And once you click on plans, you can just scroll down and click on free 30-day trial so you can get a trial of either their professional plan or their team plan so I'm just gonna click on the team plan and I'm just gonna click on free 30-day trial and I'm just gonna open up the free trial sign up so now I'm going to sign up and I'll get back to you guys in a second I'm just gonna fill out this form with my uh, name and my email address and my password now, after you have added your basic information and your basic card information, you can choose one of the organizations of your industry. So uh, whatever industry you're working in, you're going to select that. So let's just say we are working in maybe, I'm just going to find something along the lines of makeup or like a general like entertainment industry yeah so i'm working in entertainment media that's the industry i'm going for and i'm just going to click on continue now i'm going to uh describe my role in the agency so uh you can say i am an entrepreneur and i'm just going to continue with that and i'm just checking out hot sweet Hootsuite, and then I'm just a two to three person team that manage my social media. Now you can link up to three profiles or pages or groups or channels to your Hootsuite account. So I'm just going to continue with Facebook to get started and show you guys the overall Hootsuite platform. But obviously you are going to continue with the actual platform or the actual social media account that you want to manage with Hootsuite. So I'm just going to continue. Now I'm going to link one of my several pages onto Hootsuite. So I'm just gonna go with weight loss tips from a pro and I'm just going to add that and I'm gonna click on done. And I can add multiple pages as well, depending on what I want, but I'm just going to link that over here. And I'm just going to link two more pages onto my Hootsuite account. So I'm just gonna add these two as well. I'm just gonna click on done and I'm just gonna click on done over here. I'm just going to click on continue. Now you can start a scheduling posts or exploring streams. So I'm just going to click on explore streams over here so we can get started with the actual Hootsuite dashboard and start exploring the platform and how it works. And so I can show you guys how as a beginner, you're going to use Hootsuite to manage your social media account. So now I'm just opening up their basic dashboard. Now you can see on your left, you have your basic navigation panel and you have your basic create section. Now, over here, you can create different posts, pins, Instagram stories for your account, and then you have your stream. So this is going to be your content stream of how your content is going to be published, when and uh, what is the specific time that it is going to get published, all of that stuff you're going to find on the stream section. So I'm just going to click on add to dashboard so my accounts have been added to my dashboard now. I'm just going to continue now you can see that this is my stream over here i'm going to find all of the different information that i need for my overall account over here and i can view analytics as well and i can change from one stream to the other depending on what current page i'm managing now below that you have your publisher and if we open up the publisher over here now you can see over here the publisher is basically a calendar which will allow you to schedule your posts and view them in calendar form so uh, this will enable you to like get specific uh, timings on when your post is going to be posted you can view weekly calendars or monthly calendars and this will give you a nice overview of when your calendar is going to be posted when your content is going to be posted now if you click on the publisher you can just click on the content section over here and you can create different drafts or schedule posts from this section and then you have your promote section over here at the top as well in your overall publisher and you can uh, see different promoted posts that you're going to create in a certain time span because obviously if you're doing advertisements and paid advertisements those are going to be uh, a lot more important to schedule accordingly now below that you have your inbox so you can manage all of your messages and communication in your inbox so you can also monitor comments over here as well now below that you have your assignment so these can be different tasks you can assign to your team members on to Hootsuite. So 
you can see that these are tasks assigned to me by me or resolved by me i'm just gonna hide all filters or you can click on show filters and then you can add filters on what kind of items you want so any kind of message or any social network maybe you want to be working only on your facebook profile or certain team members are only working on the instagram page for your platform or your business so they can select the specific social network that they're working on and this will help them simplify their workflow as well now below that you have your advertise section now into your advertise section you have specific promoted posts on facebook especially so you have your facebook booster and you also have a linkedin booster as well so this will enable you to manage your paid posts and this is going to be especially important with paid posts being a lot more high value content than your average content that you're going to be managing now at the bottom you have your analytics so if you click on the analytics section over here you're going to find good analytics for each individual page or group or um business or social media account that you have linked so you can see over here you have your organic reporting and then you have specific reports as well and in your organic reporting you can see your post performance best time to publish general brand awareness audience growth all that good stuff you can find over here and then you have your overall engagement audience growth and click lens post engagement rates all of that stuff is available on the analytics section as well now if you click on see more over here you can have different help resources and if you click on your profile you can your team plan you can manage your separate uh, team accounts and you can install hootsuite apps as well to improve your productivity so you can add different integrations on to hootsuite as well now going back to our basic dashboard and going back to our simple uh, publishing section i'm going to show you guys how you actually get started with publishing content directly from hootsuite so what you're going to do is you're just going to click on create over here you're going to click on post and what you're going to do is you're just going to publish you're going to add your social account so maybe i want to post this to the best tips to lose weight maybe i want to post this to like several different accounts at the same time you can do that as well but i just want to post this to a singular account so i'm just going to select that one and i'm just going to click on next and what i'm going to do is i'm going to add my text so um green tea is the best drink for weight loss so i'm gonna add whatever post like that and i'm gonna see the preview over here so i can add different media files as well so if you want to upload a picture to your post you can do that as well now below that you can choose to promote this post or not now that is up to you and uh, if you want to promote a certain post you can do that but we're just going to skip that for now and then you can add your facebook target audience especially if you're promoting it so make sure that you are targeting a audience when you are doing your promotions now i'm just going to click on schedule for later because i want this to be posted on a specific time so you can select the day and time for when your post is going to be posted and it will automatically be posted on that specific time and if you want to remove the scheduled time you're just going to click on this cross over here and now i can just click on post now and this post will be posted onto my facebook page right now and this is how easy it is to get started with hootsuite and use hootsuite to manage your accounts as a beginner so i hope you guys found this video helpful and you're now able to manage your own social media accounts using hootsuite as well and if you want to invite team members you're just going to click on your profile over here and you're going to click on manage accounts and teams and you're just going to click on start collaborating with others and then you can add a organization or your social network onto your hootsuite account now just to wrap up this video i'm going to go over the basic plans that they have on hootsuite so they have the professional version starting at 49 dollars. then they have the team version which i am using which is 129 dollars, and then they have the business version for 739 dollars, and then the enterprise version which will be priced according to the features and your team size and you will get up to 10 social accounts on their basic version and up to 20 social accounts on the team version that i am using and you can schedule posts and set multiple posts to be posted at the same time as well as manage team access and assign posts and comments to specific team members on their team version so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the youtube channel and i will catch you guys in the next video